SRU today we explain unit one cognitive assessment number one from the Moasir book. Look at with me about cognitive assessment number one. Open the book page page five. Cognitive assessment on unit eight. Cognitive assessment one on unit lesson one and two unit eight. Okay. Look at with me about question number one from the opposite model. Three divided by third equals space. We have here three divided by third. To solve the example by using method, write three and convert from division to multiplication. Write inverse about one over three, it will be three. And the result will be nine. And we have here models divided at three parts. One, two, three, and each part contains of third. We have here one, two, three. Each one divided to three parts. Then we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. The value of each part here was third. Then we have nine part. Then third divided by three divided by third equal nine. In three we have how many third in three? We have nine third in three. We have nine third in three. Okay, choose here question number one, choose letter P. Question number two, seven over four. Divided by three over four. We can write seven over four and convert from division to multiplication, right reciprocal of three over four to be four over three. Reciprocal about three over four, the inverse about it. Cancel four by four and write seven times one equal seven. One times three equal three. Convert from improver to mixed number, write three. And we know three times two equals six and remainder one. Then seven divided by three equal two and remainder one. It's first question. Here, two answered. Choose the letter B about question number two. Question letter C. Mona uses six over eight cup of flour to make two cup cakes. How much flour is used to make one cup cake? We can find the number by divided by two numbers. We have the total amount six over eight cup of flour and to make two cupcakes she want to do two cupcakes how much flour is used to make one we can divide it, the total amount to the number of cupcakes she want to do two cupcakes then we will divide it, the amount six over eight divided by number of cupcakes two and then write six over eight, convert from division to multiplication, write reciprocal about two, it will be one over two. Write the inverse about this fiction because two is equal to over one, write the reciprocal about two, one over two. Reciprocal about two, one over two, and write two divided by two, one, six divided by two equal three, then the result one times three equal three, and one times eight equal eight, then the result will be three over eight. Then you must choose the letter P. What about question letter D? 4 divided by 2 over 4. You can write 2 and convert from division to multiplication. Write the inverse about 2 over 4 to be 4 over 2. 2 divided by 2 equal 1. 2 divided by 2 equal 1. 1 times 4 equal 4. Then the result here will be equal 4. Choose the letter C about question D. Letter D, he give us again. Letter D, he give us uh, 4 divided by 2 over 4, right? 4. Okay, and convert from division to multiplication, right? 4 over 2. 4 divided by 2 equal 2. 2 times 4 equal 8 and 8 divided by 1 equal 1 then the result will be 8 then letter D you must choose the result here 8 choose letter D about question D okay 
Make it example. Question letter E. From the opposite model, three divided by two over three, we won't find the result. If we won't find the result here, we must write three and convert from division into vacation, right? This will be called about two over three, it will be three over two. And the result will be three times three, it will be nine, and write it two. Nine over two, it will be four and half, okay? And what about these models we have here? Three divided by two third. We will draw three models and divide each one of them. It will be what we want. Three times three divided by two over three divided each one of them. Two parts from three colors. Okay, we want count. Count with me here. One and two, and we have three. We have here three parts, and we want to divide it three by. 2 over 3. First step, we must draw how many parts? 3 parts. We must draw 3 parts. Pay attention with me. 3 divided by 2 over 3 divided how many parts? 1, 2, 3. First step, we must draw 3 parts. We must draw what? 3 parts. And then we will divide it. Each part contains of 3. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. We have three parts here, and then we will count two from three. One, count with me, one, two, three, four. We have four numbers, and the remainder one from two parts. Again, we can solve this example by this model. First step, we must count. Here, three parts. First step, three divided by two over three. We can write what? One, two, three. You must draw three models. You must draw what? Three models. One, two, three. And you will divide it, each part from these three models. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. And then you will count two. Each two over three refers to one. Who numbers one? Then the two thirds is in three, we have four and a half. We have four and a half, two thirds in three. Again, first step, we must draw three models, one, two, three, and divide each one of them into a three. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. And we will count each two part from third, it will be one, because it's reverse to third. Each part here reverse to what? Reverse to third, here third. And here third, 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 and third. Two thirds contains of one, one, and two, three, four, and the remainder one, one part from two parts. Then the result will be four and a half. You can solve the example by this method, or you can doing this explain to find the result. Okay. Next question, letter F. Then in this example, letter E, we must choose letter P. Uh, letter A, should letter A. About question E, should letter A. Next uh, question. Letter F. Letter F, how many eights are in 3 over 4? We can write 3 over 4 divided by 1 over 8. To know how many eights in three forces, you must try three forces divided by eight. Divided by eights. Write three over four and convert from division to multiplication. Write this is called about one over eight will be eight over one. Then you can sample it eight here divided by four equal two and four divided by four equal one. Two times three equals six. One times one equal one. Six over one will be six. The result here will be six about question letter F. Okay, next question. Number two, complete each of the following. Number one, we have one over seven divided by two. You can solve this example, write one seven, convert from division to multiplication, and write the inverse about two, write the reciprocal, reciprocal about two, it will be one over two. One times one equal one, and two times seven equal 14. The result will be one over 14. 
Question letter P. 6 over 7 divided by 3 over 14. You can write 6 over 7 and convert from division to multiplication. Write the inverse about 3 over 14. It will be 14 over 3. And then sample is 3 divided by 3 equal 1. 6 divided by 3 equal 2. 7 divided by 7 equal 1. 14 divided by 7 equal 2. And then 2 times 2 equal 4. 1 times 1 equal 1. 4 over 1, it will be 4. Then the result here will be 4 about question letter B. Question letter C. We have here 5 over 8 divided by 3 over 4. You can write 5 over 8. Convert from division to multiplication. And write reciprocal about 3 over 4. It will be 4 over 3. 4 divided by 4 equal 1, 8 divided by 4 equal 2, and then 1 times 5 equal 5, 2 times 3 equal 6. It was question letter C. Question letter D. The number of 2 over 5 in 2, the number of 2 fifths in 2, right? 2 divided by 2 fifths. Write 2 and convert from division to multiplication and write reciprocal about 2 over 5, it will be 5 over 2, 2 divided by 2, 1, 2 divided by 2, 1, 1 times 5 equal 5. Then the result here will be 5 about question letter D. Question letter E. Letter E. 9 divided by 2 over 3. You can write 9 here, convert it from division to multiplication, write the inverse about 2 over 3. This will be called about it, will be 3 over 2. Okay, write the inverse about this number, and then you can sample this fraction. 3 times 9 equals 27, 1 times 2 equals 2, write 2 here. 27 divided by 2, 2 divided by 2 equals 1, and 7 divided by 2 equals 3, and the remainder 1. Then the result will be 13 over 13 and a half or 27 over 2. It was question letter E. Question letter F. The model here represents space. How many parts here? We have two models. In this example, we have how many models? Two models. And each model divided to how many parts? Four parts. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And we Go, going here, the group in this example contains of two parts, and here two parts, two parts, and here two parts. Then you can write two over the total number, two the total of numbers here, four. We have two models divided by two parts from four parts. Then this number here is the equation. They represent two models divided by this group contains of two parts from four parts. Next example, number three. A runner covered four or five kilometers in two laps. How many kilometers did he run in one lap? We know four over five kilometers is the total in two laps. Then you can divide it, uh, the numbers of kilometers, four over five divided by two, to know how many kilometers did he run in one lap. Right, four over five. This number divided by what? Divided by the number of laps, two. Okay, because he going for the distance from such that E and B, four over five, Kilometer in two lap going such that going and come start from AP and going to E. He won't find the distance in one lap. We can write four over five divided by two lap, write four over five, convert from division to multiplication, write this we call about two one over two, two divided by two one, four divided by two equal two, one times two equal two. 1 times 5 equal 5, then the result will be 2 over 5. Okay, then you can write what? 2 over 5 kilometer. This is distance about 1 lap. Question letter B. Sam has 6 liters of milk. 
he needs to divide them into small models of three fourths liter each. How many bottles does he need? Okay, we have the total amount here, six liters. We can divide it by the amount of each one in the bottle. Each bottle contains of three fourths liters, and we can write the number of bottles by divided the total amount here, six liters, by the amount in each bottle, three over four. Write six and convert from division to multiplication. Let's write the reciprocal about three over four to be four over three. Three divided by three equal one, six divided by three equal two, and then two times four equal eight. Understood? Then the number of bottles, we have eight bottles.